So we've arrived now at the Lee Valley Velodrome after two flights, 14 hours each, um, and then an extra sort of two hour bus ride to get here. Finally arrived, desperate need of a shower. Let me go, <laughs> go on and pack all the bikes and then go check out the accommodation. But James's first look at the velodrome, what do you think, man? It actually looks pretty good. Yeah? Over here. Oh, great photo opportunity. I was just saying, the only outdoor like velodrome I've ever seen is Edwardstown. Oh, yeah. So it's like, it's a bit of a step up. <laughs> yeah, yeah, just a little bit. So what's the first situation of the trip, James? What have you forgotten? Seat clamp. Seat clamp. Oh, look at that. Lost over that. Look at that boy. James is now doing full out of saddle road rides the whole time. The whole time we're here. It's just a month. I used to always want you around. So we've just dumped all of our stuff back at the accommodation and you know, jumped back in the bus and we've heard that one of the pubs down here does a $15 all you can eat wings. So in our hunger ravaged state of jet lag and Australian time zone, we're walking all the way back down here to see if this this magical thing is true. This guy, don't, don't trust this guy. Gets his all hyped on wings and then can't deliver. Can't deliver the wings. So it's day two now. We are all woke up super early this morning um, after going to the pub last night for dinner. This is gonna be my little room for the month. Pretty simple, just a bed, little desk, bike, wardrobe. Not much else, but uh, yeah, we just spent the morning, we woke up, went for a ride down the main street, got a lovely American coffee, um, and now we are packing our bikes to go check out for the track for the first time. So uh, I came here, I think two years ago now, um, but these guys, um, actually Braden came here last year, but uh, James and Matt haven't been here before. So we'll go check out the track, have a look at the 200 line, because um, we've only got racing in a couple days and try and get over this jet lag. building our bikes, head over the bridge for the first time. First track session. I think everyone's pretty keen to jump on the track for the first time. Take off some leg warmers. Enjoy the American sun. sick sun turned it on for us it was a bit windy but it was pretty good to 
roll the legs out after the 28 hours worth of flying. Young Jimmy B here. Wait, you say you'd never ridden on a concrete track? Ridden on it, but never raced on one. He's so. never raced on a concrete track, so it was a bit of a shock to the system. So Massive shock. Freaking out a little bit. Couldn't understand why the banks weren't like 45 degrees. Super bumpy. Yeah. Super bumpy. Real bumpy, but. It was nah. good though. Yeah, no, nah, it was good fun. Um, yes, yeah, gonna be a bit of an odd month with, you know, not having no indoor access or anything like that. So, now nah, it's good. And then even Jimmy B let me play with his new toy. What you get, man? Drone. The drone. drone. Cheeky drone footage. So that was pretty cool and gave another perspective to track. So.